I'm going to teach you four steps to training new landscaping employees. This changed my business. I promise you this is so easy and so powerful. All right. All right. Ready? And you're going to come back and you're going to, you're going to thank me. And I didn't make this up. I learned this from someone else and I was too stubborn to listen. Listen to me. Here's the four steps. So it'll save you tons of frustration when you got a new employee. Step one, let's just say you're teaching them how to trim shrubs, right? It could be anything, patios, cutting a lawn, mowing, whatever it is, right? So you make sure they have the proper gloves, eye protection, ear protection, safety equipment, they've signed the paperwork, you know. I'll have the employee relax and say, all right, you're get, I'll say you're getting paid, you don't have to do anything, but just hang out and just relax and watch me do the thing, okay? Now, there's a saying, slow is smooth and smooth is fast. It, it might make you feel a little anxious like I'm sitting here for hours teaching this employee how to trim bushes when the phone's ringing and there's customers and all this stuff going on but it's okay because if you just spend the time up front now it'll pay itself off over and over and over again okay so step one have them relax and just their whole job right now you tell them your job is just to hang out and watch me so you, tr you trim the shrubs and you explain why you're trimming how you're trimming you go over the safety of the shrub trimmer how not to cut your hand how to hold it properly how to start the thing what to look out for just take your time and you start trimming shrubs in front of them and have them ob observe and explain why you did what you did how it's supposed to look how you put the tarp around the shrubs you shake it off and you go over it again to catch any stragglers and say see how these look right Right now. now this customer wants these shrubs to be trimmed together into a hedge but the, another customer want, might want them to be individual squares separated some might want them to be balls or have a sense of separation it just depends on the customer but this customer wants it to be a hedge see how I you know and, and you trim it for a while and then once you feel like they've really like okay okay yeah I got it step two is you hand them the shrub trimmers and you tell them, all right, now I'm gonna hang out and I'm gonna hang out and watch you trim the shrubs, right? Do the thing. You don't actually breathe down their neck and start correcting them right away if they've never done this before. But you just hang out and then you let them start trimming and say, it's okay, you, like this is your first time doing it. You don't have to be perfect. Just take your time and learn how to do it. And then you hang out for five, 10, 15 minutes and let them trim shrubs, right? And then once you feel like there's a safe space, you can jump in and start to um, uh, critique can be like, all right, see, this one was really good, but see how you missed the stragglers underneath? So make sure that you go and you get the stragglers and you shake it off and then, and you help them, you coach them. And once they get to a point where now they're actually trimming the shrubs and you're, you're right there um, supporting them, and they're doing a good job, as soon as you get that feeling like, all right, they're getting this, right? It, it might take a few hours, but once you get to that point, step three is you say, all right, now that you have learned how to trim shrubs and you're, you're already getting decent at it, I want you to teach me how to trim the shrubs, right? So in your own words, the best way you can, just like I taught you, Turn off the shrub trimmers, and now I'm going to sit here like I'm the student, and I want you to teach me, right? So there's an accountability thing that happens in the brain that triggers, because the best way to learn something is to actually teach it. There's something that happens like when you teach something, especially when you just learned it, it instills it, it integrates it into your subconscious mind faster, okay? So, and I've watched this work in my business, like years of frustration solved in hours type stuff. Like this is a system, it's an employee training system, right? simple one so they say okay Keith uh, this is how you start it you prime it three four times you know make sure it's on choke pull it um, make sure your foot's on the, the here's the safety protocol and now that it's trimming we've got the eyeglasses ear protection gloves and then they're gonna start trimming and explaining why right and they're teaching you how to trim the shrubs and let them teach you for 5 10 15 20 minutes whatever it is until you see, as soon as they start to get confident, like they got it, you, you'll know, because there'll be a shift in the energy. Step four is where now you call somebody else, if you have somebody else, like let's say Joe is working for you too, and Joe's been working for you for a couple years. Shut off the trimmers and be like, hey Joe, Joe already knows the drill, right? Come over here real quick. All right, now we're standing here. Now I want you to teach Joe what you just learned. I want you to teach Joe this is step four. Have him teach somebody else how to trim shrubs. So now I'm, I'm standing here hanging out and now he's got the shrub trimmers and now Joe is standing there 
you know he's got the rake in his hand waiting to get back to what he's doing but he he understands the drill he teaches joe for like 10 minutes how to trim the shrubs and joe's learning now so what happens is like i've watched the shift happen and i've heard about this and it didn't make sense to me until i actually did it in my own business the the brand new guy trimming shrubs within as early as a half an hour up to three four hours gets to the point where he's confident i've literally watched a brand new guy who's never really trimmed shrubs at all before straight up trimming shrubs at decent enough quality to where all i have to do is just double check their work within within the first day so step one uh have them hang out and relax and uh watch you do the thing step while you teach them uh, step two have them do it step three they teach you and step four they teach somebody else and boom that's the four-step employee training system let me let me know what you think in the comments below and check the links below this video